thing is for chloride ion NaCl. And what we want to do is add two mils NaCl, actually one eyedropper, into LFA2. Approximately two milliliters of NaCl. To that we add nitric acid. Please note when you're using the test tube with acids, you want to have goggles on and do not point the container at anyone. And then to finalize that, we test it with silver nitrate. Please note, do not cross contaminate. Using this with this would be bad. We add a drop of we have a precipitate reaction, a very obvious reaction. Now we test for sulfate ion. Similar procedure. To this we add HCl6 molar. And when you do that, there is a slight mixing reaction. And to this, we add barium chloride. Not quite as spontaneous as the last reaction, but very similar. So how do we tell the difference? Well, when you do the chloride ion, there is a precipitate, a solid forming at the bottom, whereas the barium chloride, it turns melty white, but there is no precipitate. Now we add any HCO3 to the carbonate ion with the HCL. However, when you test for this one, it's almost an immediate reaction. So you have to add and see what happens here. Okay. We have almost an immediate reaction that tells you that there is the presence of carbonate ion.